Well, welcome to El Valle Resort. It's a thermal spa and a recreational park here for kids and adults. Um, if you wanted to see what it looks like, well, I'm glad you tuned into this video and come along for the journey. And I'll be more than happy to show you what thermal springs and a water park look like in uh, one part of Panama. Pretty cool thermal beds to lie down in. these waters here and all this water comes from the mountainous region it is said to have healing properties Anybody likes bamboo, wonder what it looks like when it's growing. There it is, fastest growing wood ever. Some of these pools are chlorinated, some are not. Um, the water is not crystal clear, but it does come from the mountains, got a lot of minerals in it. So don't be discouraged if the water is not crystal clear. These are real flowers. Just absolutely stunning grounds. Look at the flowers growing out of the trees. Wow. They have got a whole bunch of harums that they rent here and also yurts with a stunning backdrop. Oh, I think I ran the wrong way. I wanted to show you something really cool. But I haven't seen anywhere else, which is engineering marvel. It's a stunning resort with a, a volcanic mountains as a backdrop. <clears throat> so. Here's the coolest thing I've seen. So if you want this mini roller coaster to work, you gotta pedal. So the more you pedal, the faster the roller coaster moves. So it's a single horsepower roller coaster ride. Super cool. The other thing that's stunning is this entire backdrop that you see these mountains around are actually the rim of the volcano that erupted. And I'm walking in the base of the volcano that is dormant. If you watch my other video about this region, all the way around there is a massive rim of these mountains. And one of the things that I do regret not having is a good quality drone actually to show you um, so thousands of years ago this entire town um, this is the base of ground zero where the malta lava would spew out and it stopped spewing and spewed these massive mountains and uh, settled 
I'm looking one of the flattest parts in this whole region. Panama is very hilly and some really treacherous roads and so forth. But um, this place is all flat. So if you would like to see what a Panamanian thermal spring and spa looks like, this is it. This is the biggest, very quaint and quiet. My friends are staying here over the night because they've driven quite a distance and they don't want to drive back at nighttime. I've beat them to the punch. Beat them here. So I'll do a little bit more um, exploring and showing you more content that if you come down here, at least you really see what this place is like. And if it's for you, if it's for your family. is uh, one of my top 10 picks that I've visited and seen. Um, just from a lot of perspectives, there's a lot of, sh a lot of shops, restaurants, uh, places to eat, visit, and my favorite, uh, you could ride your bike anywhere around here. And if you're adventurous, uh, there's trails that go up these mountains, um, which I'm definitely gonna try out and see my fitness level. Uh, it is a lot cooler here than it is in Playa Santa Clara where I'm staying. It was a 45 minute drive from the beach all the way uphill. And um, yeah, it's just a wonderful place to cool off and to check out. And uh, yeah, it's, I would give this uh, place a seven out of 10. Unfortunately, I'm a little bit uh, uh, used to these big grand Canadian spas like uh, Nordic spa and so forth so of course my expectations are a little bit different and I have to recalibrate myself <laughs> into thinking more of a of a South America standard um, but yeah this is very pretty um, and uh, really nice experience for me to see and I hope you enjoyed the video Reminds me of uh, the beginning of Jurassic Park movie. And that's what my friend was commenting is like, how do they do a lot of uh, uh, National Geographic movies or Hollywood movies in Panama? That's a really good question because it is very picturesque. It is incredibly beautiful. Well, I'm going to town right now and Gonna go rent a bicycle and go up into the mountains and hopefully my friends didn't get lost and maybe I'll bump into them in a few hours. Take care, thank you for watching. And we'll see you on the next video.